Purple dress, blonde hair. I think that's her. I think that's her. She's running. I'm going to hurry and turn around. Now there's a truck coming behind her. It's unlocked. Ethel, jump in. Let's go. Go, go, go. Hi, I'm Jessica. And this is Andrew, by the way. What can we do for you? I want to move out. My name is Ethel. I'm 21 years old, and I'm a member of the FLDS church. One night, my mom gave us all a hug, and she was crying, and she told us all goodbye, and that she loved us, and that she would always be our mother, and then she left. And then she didn't come back. Did you just assume she abandoned you? Yeah. Do you know where she's at? No, I don't. I want to re reunite with my mom. And OK. You got a girl up at the door. OK, go. Hey. Are you ready? Yeah. OK. Wait, your sister's going to help you move? One of them wants to. What? Who's that? Our grandmother. Wait a minute. What is going on? Go forward. Go forward more. What? Is this real life? Wait a minute. What are you doing? I to take this thing off. What's going on? Her grandmas are awake. Her and grandparents they, are awake? They said, what are you doing? People at the door, people at the door. Let's go. We're going to go get more stuff. Ethel? What? What is going on? I'm going. Why? Because. Is it open? <sighs> Of the gunshots. The light just went on over there. Oh my gosh, she's calling somebody. Matt. All right, you got it. Matt. Matt. What? Grandma's on the phone. She's on the phone. Okay, well, let's go. This whole place is lighting up. Right here, right here, right here. We got lights over here. Somebody's on the road. We got to get out of here. How much more we got? This is it. That's it? OK. Matt, there's another car coming. We're going to get confronted. Yeah. OK, let's get out of here. Let's go. OK, there's a car coming up on your left. I'm just sitting down there with his lights on. Do you think they're trying to block us in? Where is it? Jump in. We're clear. Are you ready? I see your mom. You. What's the matter? Talk to me. You just wasn't there anymore. I'm so sorry, Amy. I never wanted to leave. I moved away because I was told that was Warren's desire is that I move on and go away. I was told that rebellious women would not be tolerated and that I was being made an example and that I was the first lady being told to go away. That if I wanted any hope for my kids, I would leave. <laughs> you guys can have a salvation. <laughs> so I'm like, if I suffer and put it be punished, then you guys will be OK, which was stupid, because you guys needed me too. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Come here. <laughs> After seeing my mom, I'm just quite overwhelmed to hear why she really left and stuff. It just, it just kind of breaks my heart. I missed you so much. I missed you too.